Okay, February 15th, 2015, and we're at 5049 Maui Circle, which is right there. That's my car on the side of the screen. Here in the Island Club at Rosemont. It's got a great condominium association. 345 a month or so. Covers all exterior maintenance, including the roof and the landscaping. I'm Realtor Scott Garrison, 407-339-3200. This is definitely affordable and beautiful living. This is what you see when you drive in every day. It's got an island theme. Zero lot line, you really don't have any lot. See on the right there, you're attached to that other house and then it's freestanding in the back. This is going to be a video tour of this vacant bank-owned property. But before we go inside, I'm sure you want the advantage of this one, how close it is to the common areas. So there's probably about eight or ten units in the whole development where you can go out your front door, which we just saw, walk down this little path, do, 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 do. just a couple of seconds. And you are in the community pool. So not only do you have a pool in your unit, you also within walking distance of this private community area. And that's your unit right there. Talk about nice. Of course, all this is included in the condo association dues. Got the this so we'll walk into the front. So you can see over there, a little around to the right of that building right there, is the mailboxes. A little building area, and that's the main street. I've got another video of the whole common area as well. If you type in Island Club here on YouTube. But because this one is actually in the backyard of this unit, I do it. So there you are from the back. It's very private. I just talked with someone from the HOA who says that because everyone has their own pool, hardly anyone uses this pool, so it's very, very quiet and private. And I'm trying not to fall doing all this. So why are we out here? Because this is actually your backyard, which hardly anybody else can say. See them? They can't say that. There's another unit here. So we're coming around to this side. And if we look here, we're gonna see that in just a minute. So you come right out your living room, right out here. And on nice days like today, not only do you have your own private pool and a community pool, but you've got all this as your own backyard, which you don't have to keep up with. So we're going along the back, there's your electric meter inside of there. They take care of everything here. And they'll keep it in about the same condition, of course. Not allowed to have annuals for landscaping, but anything that's a non-annual can put in. And we're coming back to the outside here. All right, I'm gonna pause it. All right, so here we are, brand new garage door. And we are in the foyer right here. Got nice Chattahoochee. That's the other, you can see the difference where the floor mat was, but you can see how nice it comes back if you just bleach it, polyurethane it. And of course, to see the floor plan, come in, two bedrooms, two baths, built in 1978. Welcome home. Of course, it's going to be a little dark. There's no power. There's no water. This would be considered the master bedroom. And this is the only island here in Island Club where you have these plank or beam ceilings, which are just beyond beautiful. Give you such a tropical feel. I put a new fan in there that was more tropical. Got the Bahama shutters. Got nice long closets here. And the bathroom. Skylight for extra light. Could use a little paint and care up there. 
This has been empty for several years, three or four years, and given that, it's in really good shape. And that goes right out to the pool. We'll see that in just a minute. You've got a nice size, bright, private place. From what I understand, you can see um, where the ceiling is there. From what I understand, the owner added that and took that and took some space out of the garage to give you room for an extra table in here, which makes the place exceptionally spacious. That's a nice island type fan. Let me get a couple of those in here. Look at that fireplace. And that custom job. And we're going out to the pool area. Remember, it has been empty for a long time. But it would clean up really easy. Talk with the owner's um, friends who used to spend time here. Nice fireplace. And they always said what a cute unit this was. And how solid it was. The AC is new. And you say, why is that there? That is over 10 years old. And that's just a small leak from right in there. It happens. Just should be probably taken out. Or you could probably clean it up. Anything out for 10 years is going to look that way. And there's your atrium. Your view out the kitchen. View out a living bedroom. Go right out there to the community area. Look at this kitchen. Beautiful cabinets. What you need is an AC, put new appliances in or not. Anything you buy from the bank, you're going to end up painting, put new door fixtures in, some flooring. This is old wallpaper that someone painted over. It's starting to peel. It's peeling a little down there. That's normal. Again, after years and years and years. It's going to have to be taken down. There was a Murphy bed here. You can still see the screws right down there. Small little leak in the ceiling. Talked to the HOA. They said, you know what? Leak repair, it's covered. Just put in a work order. We'll come out and make sure it's not leaking anymore. Nice closet. This would be considered the second bathroom. And that's the door out to the pool. So if you look really close, you may not be able to see in the video. Originally, the door was right there. Originally. And this was probably a bigger closet. And for some reason, they really wanted it to be through this way. If you wanted to bring it back, put the door in there. I don't know if you can see, just maybe you can see the outlines of where the door was. Certainly would make it more if you had guests over. I personally like it the way it is. Let's go look into the garage. So the AC's newer. This is built in 1978. And it's dark and spooky, of course, in here. Now, you can see, this is the area that he added on. Give you a little more room. Air handler's in great shape. Hot water heater looks brand new. They moved the washer and dryer. I'm sure it was over there. I'm sure they moved it there. That's where it goes. And this is a huge garage. I mean, it's huge. Two and a half cars. They used to have a refrigerator here. Plug it in right there. Right, they got the cabinets built for it. Got your ceiling fan. For that nice indoor, outdoor living. You can open up all of the blind, all the windows here. And because this is screened, just let the air flow through the house. I'm Realtor Scott Garrison. If you have any questions about this or any island club at Rosemont property, call me. The way the buyer for this that I'm working with today found it is I set up a list, and as soon as one came on the market, this one, she got an automatic email so that she didn't miss it. If you're looking the same way, call me. I'll set up a list for you, no cost and obligation, and you won't miss the next one. Thanks.